Hey guys, so I just did a live video not long ago and then I had to go like check on the kids at the park. <laughs> so we've got this like a couple of moms in the neighborhood and we're just kind of like passing our kids around this afternoon. Um, one of their kids was complaining about being so bored and she was sick of hearing about it. My kid about broke my car window with a ball. I'm like, that's it. Like, let's just get them out of the house. So, uh, yeah, I'm on break for a minute. This is the first time I haven't been with my kids in a while. It's kind of nice. But I did a live video and then I asked for any questions that you guys were curious about me answering. And one of the questions that I got, which is pretty like kind of a big question, it is, but it isn't, is do I ever wish that I was still with my ex-husband? That was a big, this is like a huge question because I could see how this could go one extreme way or like another. Now, first of all, I don't really enjoy talking about him anymore. He's like so in my past that it's just the only thing I ever really talk about regarding him is, you know, if for some reason I need to vent with one of my girlfriends, that's it. And I mean, that, that's really, I would say it. Now the person, do I ever wish I was still with him? Short answer? No, not at all. Uh, longer answer. It's because of who he is now. I feel like the person that I was with, we were together for six years. We were together for five years. We got engaged. We were engaged for a year, got married. We had like re three really good years of marriage and then the drugs came and it kind of just all went to crap, as you guys know. And I would say the last two years of our marriage were pretty, pretty rough. So in that time though, the, the person that I married, you know, fell in love with, married, had kids with, that person is gone. Like completely gone and I mean somebody may beg to differ but I genuinely think that that whole like meth changes the chemical makeup of your brain is like real deal I, I swear to you he is a completely different person and and you know maybe not always in a bad way like it just he's just a completely different person he's not the person that I fell in love with he's not the person I married that person's gone so no, I don't wish I was still with him at all. Now, um, and, and nor nor do I wish that I was still with who he used to be because I was I'm sitting on the bed like a little crooked and I was did that live video for like 20 minutes. Now my back hurts like because my bed is like, I'm slowly like sinking off of it. I'm trying to correct this, the sinkage here. But uh, yeah, so he is just different. And no, I don't wish that I was still with the person that he was before the drugs. Like I don't like sit around and think like, oh, like I wish... You know, I wish we could go back to that time. I haven't had that thought cross my mind even once. I am so incredibly happy right now and with the relationship of mine right now that I just, there is nothing that, I mean, I feel like in a weird, really weird way, everything kind of worked out the way that it was supposed to. I know it's not traditional or ideal or whatever, but I feel like it is exactly what it was supposed to be and exactly how it was supposed to happen. Maybe, maybe not, I don't know, but I, you know, I, I don't miss him. Now, there are some, gosh, I can't even say that I like miss things that we did because I do different things now or like we did a lot of really fun camping trips and I have fond memories of that time and that person that, you know, fathered my kids, but I don't, I don't even miss those. So, uh, yeah, my answer is no, I don't. And and I hope that doesn't like come off as being like cold hearted or anything like that. Um, there's also been a lot of time since my divorce and you know, he and his wife seem happy. I don't, I mean, I don't know, but they seem really happy and yeah. So, um, yeah, there's the answer to that question. The other one I was asked about is kind of an essential oil question. So I'm going to go grab some of my favorite oils right now and do a video about those. But, uh, yeah, I hope that helps. I hope that answers that question. <laughs> I will talk to you guys soon. If you have any other ones, just let me know. Leave them down below. I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye.